Hi, I'm Xiao. I'm an exchange student from Jose University, Tokyo, Japan. Today, I'm going to introduce you our fantastic Apple application, Hither Road. First, I have a question for you. Do you like to travel? I love travel very much. <laughs> However, I find it so troublesome and it takes such a long time for me to make a travel plan. We asked 52 people about how long did you spend on planning travel. Most of them answered around 6 to 9 hours. That's such a long time. And we also asked them which takes you the most time. And about 60% of them answered to find a road to go to the sightseeing spot. That's the problem which I face when I make a travel plan. So if there is an application which can solve this problem, why don't you to use it? Here is Hither Road. Let me show you how it works. Hello, my name is Christine, and I will be guiding you through the Hit the Road app today. Uh, when you start the application, uh, this will pop up on the screen for you. Welcome to Hit the Road. Just click on Hit the Road button right here, and there will be four options for you outlined here. Start a new trip, share your diary, find a buddy, and be a buddy. And all four of these options I will explain to you right now. Let's click on the first option, start a new trip. We want to go to the Harajuku Shrine in Sh Tokyo, Japan. So let's uh, hit the road. It looks like there's a travel diary right here in the Meiji Jingu Shrine. Let's click on it. It's spring now. So here is an example of a diary that um, someone posted here at the shrine telling, telling um, others about their experience and what they did, um, maybe a photo, and, um, and we will look at more information that is outlined in each diary. So you, we can figure out how to go there based on the diary, the cost based on the diary, and the opening hours based on the diary. Um, let's figure out how to get there first. It says stop at Harajuku Station, then walk for 10 minutes. If we click on that, we can see how to get there from the um, rail line and the user um, showed us a guide of how to get there. The second option is share your diary. You will be given um, different selections of things to fill out for your diary for each destination or each scenic area that you um, go to. So you can big, um, fill out the title, the contents, cost, opening hours, how to get there, and the option of any other destinations you would like to take. That means that you can uh, link up other destinations that you went to during your trip or your travel experience. So your third option is find a buddy. So you can find a buddy by the destination name of the area that you want to go to, or you can find a buddy by the map. Looks like we're still going to want to go to the um, shrine, so let's see if there are any people around the area. There are a lot of people around the area, and these are also your contact list. Let's click on show, because we know him best. And um, it will just give a little description of the show's profile and like a picture of him, who he is, um, just a little bit more about him. And you have the option if you click on contact me to contact him via message or contact him via, um, it'll just give you more information of how to contact him if you want to, if you want him to be your buddy for travel. The fourth option, although we won't click on it today, is be a buddy. So you have the option of being a buddy wherever you are traveling to. So these are the main features of Hit the Road. I hope you like it. And we're gonna launch it in Japan at first, and then in the US and in China. So why do we use Hit the Road? First, Hit the Road is your best travel partner, which provides you provide you most concrete and personalized travel information. Second, it's social network. You can show your diaries with others. 
Third, if you're gonna be a body, you can do cultural exchange with people from other countries for free. When I was in Japan, I, I made a group which met people from other countries in order to practice my English. Students in Japan love such an opportunity. Fourth, you can also choose to get some payment if you guide someone. <laughs> About our market skills, well, uh, there are 1,087 million people travel around in the world in 2013, and in Japan, about 30 million people come to visit Japan in 2014 and make consumption of 1.6 billion dollars. Also, in 2020, Japan is going to hold Tokyo Olympic Games, so there must be more and more tourists come to visit Japan, and there must be a very big business chance for us. So we mainly get revenue from advertising the local business. We will publish our official diaries for restaurants, hotels, or shops, and get advertisement fees. Also, users who write about the restaurants or shops can get some discounts from them. We are pretty aggressive. Our goal is to get 10 million users and get 1 million net profit by 2019. I believe with our strong team members, we can provide you the best service and let your travel be more fantastic. Thank you for listening. <laughs> um, what, can you talk a little bit about competition? I suppose, oh, yeah. especially in Japan. Uh, first, the uh, about the tri uh, trip advisor is our computer. So yeah, it's really easy to use. However, we focus on personalized travel information, but tri trip advisor are focused on the more business uh, view. Yeah, so that's our different points for our computer. How will you, uh, I'm wondering how much resources you will need to get your uh, sponsors? Mm -hmm. First, we are going to find uh, local, uh, local tourism association to advertise our application for them uh, and find some resources from them. Next, we are also going to uh, find some because I'm I really active, actively uh, do my act, uh, free guide for people come to Japan. So we're gonna connect to other groups with uh, free guides. So let them advertise our uh, make our channel for people who come from other countries. What about the local businesses who are going to advertise and generate the revenue? I assume you're going to need thousands of them in Tokyo is a big place. Yeah, but I believe first uh, we can mark uh, how many places they are come to visit at first and we, we may wait them and uh, advertise them um, one by one or by social network service and to yeah, let them know our service. I uh, no noticed in your business plan you made a uh, specific uh, proposal for uh, investors, $100,000 to buy 20%, implying that the current business as it is before the money is worth $400,000. Just wondering, how did you, uh, how did you generate that uh, proposal? Mm. I get the proposal from... Mm, yeah, just from most business person that I research, yeah, and generate them by my assumption, yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you.